Okay, we are back and we are repairing some of the steps, uh, the brick steps on the front porch. Now, of course, this wasn't installed correctly. Over time, you can tell it just it became loose. It just wasn't, there's no mortar or cement between the steps. So they're just falling apart, crumbling a little bit. And there's weeds growing through here. So last fall, I noticed it started getting really bad. And I had some construction adhesive at the time. So it was a quick fix. It did a decent job, but I knew it wasn't going to be long term. So uh, I want to show you what worked for me. I already done three or four steps already. And I'll show you a couple over here. Using the Quickrete Fast Set from Home Depot for about seven bucks. I did this step and I did this step. I'm going to, I did these later at night. So I'm going to put some more in here as well to kind of fill in the cracks on the sides a little bit better. This looks pretty, this is real, actually really good. And it dried really well, probably 24 to 48 hours completely dry. So um, I'm going to be filling it up. This one is, was really good as well. This one I did. And then I just did one over there as well. And I'm going to be showing you how I did this one. So um, here's what we did. So pretty cheap and easy project. Um, pretty simple. Of course, this is what works for me and for the time being. So um, I already put down some of this quickrete fast set concrete mix here on, the, on here, smoothed it out. First, what I did is I took a leaf blower and I just blew all this stuff out. And I had some old adhesive on here. I scraped most of this up um, with, a, with a utility knife. So... That worked for me, and I always want to, before I put the water down, just kind of place it, just kind of dry fit it and see how it's going to be. It looks pretty good. Um, I'll probably put a little bit more up here just to make it more level, so we'll do that. Let's do that right now. I don't need too much, but just a little bit more so that it sits right and sits flush fairly level so so let's just try to smooth it out best we can of course it's not going to be perfect I'm not trying to be a perfectionist here but I want to do the best I can with what I have keep it smooth dry fit it again okay so a little bit more up front still just to make it level do that okay much better um, looks pretty good in there and then I'm gonna put some on here and on the back crack and on the sides so what I want to do first is get this wet and you never know how much to put on but it just has to saturate it I'm not worried about making a mess I have a hose here for the next step so just get a good puddle on it You can always put a little bit more in there if you need to. I'm going to place it good. Okay, so now it sits pretty flush. And then, now, fill up the sides and back. You have to do this a couple times, depending on how, how much is back there. But this worked for me pretty good. First couple times I did it, and it's cheap. Obviously, I'm not paying tons and tons of money to redo the front steps right now. So, just so it's safe and secure, prevent lawsuits, whatever. Just want to be a responsible homeowner, so, and do my due diligence. Fill up some of the cracks really well, as you can see. Just do the best you can. Try to jam it in there, wedge it in there. Same with the other side. Okay, so you get the point. Smooth it out real good. Probably a little bit more in the back. Just use a little bit at a time until you see it's getting full. jam it in there take any of the excess and just dump it in there if you need to this way it gives it a good foundation keep it sturdy all the way around it 
the other ones seem to do a pretty good, good job, so why, why change it up? And then I'm going to pour some more water in the back and the sides. Let that sit. Okay, so now that I have a big mess, what do you do? No problem. You take the hose, turn it away. So, that's pretty much it. About 24, 40 hours, it should be good. So, that'll clean it up, and that's pretty much it. So, hope you found this helpful. Uh, please stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching, and be sure to like and subscribe. Thanks, guys.